All right, Sly. Your mission this time is to take this USB drive. It's filled with all of my favorite turtle porn, and I don't want Murray accidentally finding it. Or worse, finding it and deleting it. Yes. We're all set to go to Mesa City. All right, so now we can start. <laughs> Two gay guys play. I'm Randy, and I'll be making stupid turtle jokes and impressions this whole episode. <laughs> and I'm Andrew, and I will be attempting to play. Attempting is a good word, even though you've been kicking butt the whole time. Mug shot. Oh no, oh hey. He's a dog. I think. Oh no, he's big, I'm into it. <laughs> Turns out he wasn't always that way. Aww. He grew up as the run of the litter. The neighborhood he, they're so poorly animated, but yeah, like, it they're is, adorable. It is just <laughs> the, the dog, dog father. He was there that he spotted his first gangster. Ah. First one, that's what he wanted to do. Wow. He spent the rest of his youth working real hard. Yeah, fueled on his and then just mustache. I mean, that, that's how you know, right? Yeah. When the acne is replaced by the mustache, you're an adult. Yeah. And you're smoking cigars. You are adult. You become a hard-boiled street brawl. I kind of wish they didn't grow up, so he's just beating up children, <laughs> <laughs> shooting them repeatedly. I guess. Uh. Uh. He's from Texas, right? Oh no, we're going to Nevada. Yeah. So I just figured he's a cowboy of Moo Mesa. Loving gun. I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. <laughs> Get out. Nope. No more Red's Wicked Apple for you. It's all mine now. <laughs> there is so little left in this. Is there? Oh, okay. <laughs> there is. Sunset. Snake eyes. Snake eyes. Don't kiss me on the show. That's gay. Yeah. Hmm. Do you guys play? Oh, that's why we named it that. Doing but stuff and being gay. Do you guys play? Are you just singing to Wee Bear Bears? Yeah. But talking about two gay guys play. Okay, that's fair. And butt stuff. And butt stuff. Which is important. Hey Sly. hey Sly, how's the USB drive going for you? This, this was 2002. Like so like a CDR. <laughs> a CDR full of turtle porn. Oh, yeah. What do you say we take off? I remember, what was it, like 2000, when did I go to college? 2006, I had a USB drive that was, could hold up to one gigabyte. Wow. Yeah, I had 256 megs, and I was just like, I don't even know what I'm going to do with this. I could have like three or four episodes of Naruto fan subs on mine, which I would take to work. So I'm like, all right, I am set for an hour and a half of my six-hour shift. Which I would run out of anime pretty fast, because my job involved me doing a whole lot of nothing. I liked it. I mean, it ruined my work ethic for a bit, <laughs> but to like, be fair, yeah. hey buddy, see you. Uh, get wrecked. Like my uh, my main concern with like watching or listening to anything while I'm working is not that it's wrong, because if I've got nothing better to do, mm. I shouldn't, you know, be at the beck and call of whatever. True. Uh, my complaint is that like I'm just gonna be like. <sighs> I could be doing my job and getting paid. Or, well, here's a thought. It wasn't that I was just bad at my job, it was my job didn't demand a lot of me. So, like, I was a supervisor at the movie theater, which means doing a whole lot of nothing. Uh, I got to sit in the office, um, and I just had to go start movies once in a while. We were supposed to go and clean the theaters after every showing, but if we were like, eh, there was only like 14 people in there, we don't have to go clean up. I'm sure they didn't make too big of a mess. We just continue hanging out and reading books, watching movies, and all the other fun stuff while yelling at other people to make sure that they are making popcorn and cleaning back there and closing stuff for the night. That sounds pretty delightful, actually. Like I said, it ruins work ethic because you just don't want to do anything. <laughs> like, I would stay till after close, and, uh, like, I had the security monitor so I could see, like, whatever was going on in the lobby. And I'd be like, oh, I see someone's coming out to get a be like a refill at 11.30 p.m. when we're, like, the lobby is closed. And I could go out and just help them. Or... If they really want soda, they'll come and knock on the office door. Yes. So I'm like, nah. Except for then you'd have the jerks who are like, nah, I'll just do it myself. And they'd reach over the counter to do it. Um, but, like, we had disassembled, like, the nozzles. So then it would just spray out everywhere. And like, it's like, <sighs> why can't I get free unlimited soda? Yeah, why can't I reach over a counter and help myself? Like, for that reason, you don't know what you're doing. Whoa. And, and super dead. Uh, yeah. uh, oh, that's right. You uh, just lose the thing. You gotta yeah. be sneaky sneaky. Yeah, Not anymore, you don't. Well, I have... Oh, 
I get back over there then? Because I like went a different way. Yeah. But because I got a cutscene, I know this is the way it was supposed to go. There you uh, go. All right, that worked out better than I expected it to. Leap of faith. There just wasn't a big old box of hay for you to fall into. Nope. Nope. I know you like your creeds of the assassins. I do. I'll get Syndicate when it's cheaper. There you I, go. I don't think I've ever paid sixty bucks for an Assassin's Creed game. Me neither. Uh, I've only paid up to. Five dollars, and I have a whole bunch of them. No, oh. thanks, Steam sales. Oh, see, I uh, one, I did not get into Steam games until relatively recently. And mm -hmm. two, like <sighs> everything, everyone I've talked to who like likes the games, yeah, it, when I was first getting into them, is like, don't play them on Steam; they're garbage. Well, which is true. The first one, like that port, is kind of bad. And, and also, like, it didn't help, like, the first time I played it, I didn't have a controller, so mouse and keyboard controls were wonky. Yeah. Oh, and the controllers. And, like, you play or whatever. Yeah. The thing was the second one that I was told that, like, if That's it cracks, it, it. Yeah, if, uh, the online service crashes, you can't play the single player. Yeah. Which is insane to me, yeah. like, as a concept. I bet it is. And I remember playing 4, where, uh... No, it was uh, Unity, which I guess is fine. Yeah. That, uh, because I had DLC installed, mm -hmm. and it couldn't verify the DLC because, because the server was down, uh, I couldn't load the single player game I legally purchased. Uh, and then they were like, I don't understand why people pirate. I'm <laughs> like, bitch, I do. Yeah, I totally get it now. Whoa. Oh. Hi, dog. <laughs> Hi, Dalmatian and weird, like, overall pants. Well, it's... Or suspenders. Yeah, he was in, like, suspenders and a, and a uh, button-up shirt. I think? I don't know, I thought he was shirtless. I mean, that's Could fine. Be. That's fine. Yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna complain about shirtless dudes. Be them dog men or otherwise. Muscles are muscles? Is that what you're saying? Correct. Oh, I can I can understand that. Do I... Is that, that's where I'm supposed to be going. Like, I would hope by this point they had five figured out and you could just play it. Because you know, you're playing on PS4, right? For, uh... For five and four, I suppose, right? Uh, yeah, I have four... I, I have Black Flag, which I think is four. Yep. Uh, and Weirdly, I, I have barely played any of these, but I know yeah, which I'm, ones are what. I've got, uh, Unity, which I... Yeah, which is fun. Yeah. That's right, because after four, you stop numbering things. I mean, th th that's how you know. You've had too many. I missed a couple back there. Which is funny, because, you know, Kingdom Hearts doesn't even have a three yet, but we've got tons of non-numbered things. There's like 45 of those games. There is eight. Which is a lot. Yeah, like, I notice you're not denying that number. <laughs> you're just... Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, there's a lot of remakes and collections. Well, because, like, they've basically remade every game in the series at this point, Well, right? remade, they remade two. They did two of them? Well, they're all like they did recoded. HD remakes, right? Well, Recoded is an entirely different game than Coded was. Coded was for mobile phones in 2009. Oh. Um, the far past. Yeah. And Recoded is a 2011 DS version. Oh. Um, with entirely different mechanics. Um, I'm trying to remember. It seems like there's another one I'm forgetting that they just completely remade. Is it like the HD remixes aren't like remakes? No, those are just remasters. Oh, all right. Which is taking everything that already exists and then just upresing it. All right. Yeah. Looking for balls. Yeah. Well, I will be looking for balls. I'm missing one. Oh, I've only got two. <laughs> I'm like hitting on you hardcore. That's adorable. I mean, I'm into that. Yeah. Uh, can you grab onto that thing and climb lower? Yes. Oh, I might have been down below. I remember I had a hard time climbing too. Where is it? Since I've turned off the security, yeah, it'll be a bit easier. I can just run path back through this. Right. I'm sorry that I'm insane. No, I think you should get them, especially when you're this close. Because otherwise, I'm gonna come all the way back. And there's always like really useful abilities. Yeah, that's the big deal. Like, they are all crazy. Probably right near the beginning or something. Yeah. It always is. I don't remember if, the, if 
I don't remember if it's this game or uh, one of the later ones. You can always hear them. Ah, yeah, that would come in handy. Wait, there it is. Yep, good job. Now my question is, where was the vault? Oh. Oh, jump down lower. Can you? No, I don't think that's an actual platform. I don't remember coming across the vault. Probably near the end. Near the end. So if you see it, you know. I will scream and shout. Great. Sorry, twist and shout. No. Don't ugh me. <laughs> I do like in, I mean, in the, that's in most of these games, like, if you have to backtrack. Since you disabled the security, it's much faster. Yeah. And secure. But disabling security isn't automatic. Yeah. You have to, A, remember to, like, remember to take care of it. Well. We'll just come back and find it real quick. Probably, like, right at the beginning. Yeah. Yeah, because that's an exit. Right. Okay. Where is the same? It's very weird. Yeah. Well, let's head all the way back. Leave and then come back. Look the level select or whatever. Yeah. Mug shots. Tiff. Tio. I assume. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I have the key. I just don't have the safe. No. Nope. Going back this way anyway. Oh, and security is re-enabled. Shit. I forgot about that. That's okay. Let's do it. Keep a lookout for the safe. I always am. At least this way you can disable all the security ahead of time. It's on this side. Yep. Enemies will respawn, but whatever. I ain't afraid of no goats. I assume there are goat enemies. Oh, yeah. Okay. There's there it, there is a wide variety of anthropomorphic things in these games. Oh, of course. I'm kind of in like chain gang Huckleberry Hound. <laughs> oh, and I did not die. Sure, whatever you say. Well done. One more. Hey, buddy. See ya. There you go. There you go. Sure. And another horse. Off go. Just trying to find the safe. That's all I want. Keep on going back. All right. We're gonna have to do the whole jump. Whoa. Uh. All right. Whatever. I guess. What the fuck is this? What is happening? You're okay. No. Oh, now it's I just okay. don't have any defense. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of hard to. Fine. Hit. Whatever. You can do it. Where you going? He's going back towards the end of the stage, which is our beginning of it. Hey, that's right. I'm gonna do that. How do I turn it off? Alright, come on. I guess I'll give you one of those. What an asshole. Also, just seeing if there's like breakable shit. Yeah. The safe might be behind. Sure. Friend of mine watching this, being driven completely insane by my inability to remember where shit is. If you see it. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking. Don't worry. All right. My eyes are on the screen. Let me emphasize, I have never at any point stated that I'm good at video games. <laughs> you uh, stated the up multitude. Are we back up? Yep. Get to the back of the car. There you go. Mm. It's likely very close to the beginning. Yeah. The problem is it's hard to, like, warp back to this area. Yeah. Oh, shit. That's right. I can't make that jump. I can't. I think I can't. 
Um, yeah, see the hook thing there. Mm -hmm. Nope. It's okay. Now I'm good. just past a checkpoint, so we will... I think I have, like, one life left, because this game is old. Oh, yeah. Lives. Yeah. Alright. Uh, I had to get... I had to do this. Yeah. Here. Hey, don't rush. Agreed. Alright. Back at the beginning. Almost. Really? Yeah. Really? Yep. This game is a gift. Just remember, you did beat this stage, so even if you die, good. I don't know if I keep the uh, things, though. No. That's my concern. There. Let's find out. They don't remember seeing the vault. That's my other concern. I don't know where the fuck it is. Like, at all. Okay. Go on. Or not. Alright. Wanna call and try to get on the next episode? Or do I've you wanna... never gotten a game over on this game before. Uh, Alright. Yeah, let's call the episode here and then see if we can figure it out. Sorry about that, everybody. We'll check you next time on 2 Gay Guys Play. Yeah.